Hello friends, my name is Kishan and welcome you in this video tutorial. In this video tutorial, we are going to discuss about the uh, default methods which are available in the map interface. So if you look into the JDK 1.8, then you can see, I mean, a lot of default methods have been added in JDK 1.8 uh, version. So let's press Ctrl Shift and try to search for the map which is available in the package it's called java.ut and if you press ctrl o then you can see the list of methods which is available in the map interface so you can see a small sign over here wherever you see a, a small sign as a d all are default method means we know that in java 8 onwards we can define method method inside a interface itself so basically in this video tutorial we are going to talk about the uh, uh, some default methods and i will i would like to start from the first default method that is called get or default so you can look into the java doc saying that returns the value to which the specified key is mapped or default value of this map contains no mapping for the key so let's create a map over here so i'm going to create a map having key as integer integer and value as a string right so let's say i i would say emp map right and i'm going to you can initialize with any map implementer so here i'm going to use a uh, hash map so you can take any implementer imp imp implementation of map so let's take a hash map uh, press ctrl shift o for organize import now i'm going to add few elements in this map so map is a method is called put so here you will have to pass the key let's suppose we are passing the employee id as a key and value as a employee id so value i'm take key i'm taking as an integer and value as a string so i'm taking name as martin now let's add few more elements in this map with the different employee IDs. So Martin, second employee, I'm going to add Frank. And Andrew. Now, uh, I want to show you how we can make use of get or default so get of get or default takes two parameter first parameter you need to pass uh, a key for which you want to derive the value and if this key is not available in the, this map then you we want to specify the default value so if value is available for that key in this map that will get retrieved if value is not available for that key then default value will be returned so here i'm gonna specify key as one one lakh one right and value i'm going to specify rocky so here if you look into the map so one lakh one is not available as a key so of course this is going to return you the rocky itself that is a default value itself right so I would say result and if you try to print result then let's see what we get. So if I run this application then we are getting a rock. So let's suppose I am using one of the key which is available in the map. Then in this case as value is available with this key so this value will be retrieved instead. Uh, instead getting the rock we will get the frank so let's save this client program and let's try to run it so in this case we are we are still getting rock so here key is available still we are getting rock that was not supposed to happen oh sorry I was just I need to pass this as a integer right so if I try to retrieve then we get the 
Frank as the output, right? And if I specify some new key, then we'll get the raw key itself, right? So I hope you understood how we can make use of get or default method, uh, which is available in map interface. So let's proceed to uh, have look next uh, default method. So if I go to the map interface and try to press Control O, then we have a second method is called for each, right? So for each you can see for each method takes by consumer as a, uh, a functional uh, as a argument, right? And we know that by consumer is a functional interface, and by consumer has a functional method is called accept. So as as you can see by consumer is annotated with the at the rate functional interface that means it is it's a functional interface which is having only one abstract method so here we have chance to write a lambda expression for this method right so basically this accept method accept method accept method takes two input parameters and return nothing so here we can write lambda expression for this accept method so let's come to client program and here using uh, for each we can iterate right map so here uh, for each takes by consumer as an argument so let's define a lambda expression for this so it's a map so let's say let's say k represents key and v represents value so let's write a lambda expression for this so here basically just we are we are going to print key and value from map right so that's it now if I try to run it then sorry so there is some compilation error so we have a key as well as value system dot out dot print and key I want to so k k is a key and separate with tab and v right so there is some parenthesis so i think right if i try to run it then you got the key value pairs right so this is a, another way to iterate map so in earlier version of jdk like still jdk 1.7 we had a method like uh, you can see uh, entry set right you can make use of entry set to iterate map another method you have a key set right key set this will give you the set of keys from the map and you pass the every key to the map and you get the corresponding value right but java 8 onwards we can make use of the for each loop to iterate uh, uh, map right so in this list so in this do demo we have looked into two default method first was get or default map and second was for each in next video tutorial i'm gonna look into next default method so please be with me over there and thanks for watching this video and this source code i'm going to upload on the github so that you can download and you can run on your local machine so see you in next video tutorial and thanks for watching this video